So that is before, and actually what we currently have in GNOME 42. Traditional menus let's say, with sloppy focus, that come with high interaction speed, and boosting muscle memory a lot. But they can get error prone, they can't handle complex hierarchies quite good, and they definitely aren't touch friendly. And that's the after, that we'll more likely see in GNOME 43. Now we're dealing with popover like menus, that require click to expand. They certainly aren't performing that fast, but eventually will save you from these clicks, they can deal with lots of nesting, and they will work fine with touch. When you're looking to the transition to GTK4 and to the more modern GNOME, I'd say that is one of the most significant changes UI side, even if it hasn't earned the attention it deserves. Personally I love it, although there are situations that the old way could be more efficient. But is it really worthy to make a mix, and have people confused with two UI patterns that serve the same purpose?